So this material is 200 times stronger than steel. This one is a shirt. We we'll have to go around to see it up front. And uh, this, it's made out of forest fibers, out of uh, material made out of uh, tree, mater tree parts. And it's recyclable. So this is a, a car. Yes, so this is an electric car. Uh, by the company Polestar mm -hmm. and electric cars are already sustainable but uh, what they're doing differently is for the interior of the car they're actually using 100% recycled plastic oh, okay. to make the material called nylon 6 for the interior of the car and that's what the material made from this forest uh, no this one is made out of recycled plastic ah, recycled this material plastic. yeah ah, okay. so they're using discarded fish nets to actually make this the material for the interior of this car okay. yeah are you ready? Ready? From the Swedish. From Sweden's forest. From a region called Dalarna. Temperwood? This is Timberwood and this tree is made is called spruce. Now you might ask yourself how is that sustainable and you're cutting trees from the forest? Pavilion made completely out of wood. All these trees around you, they've been harvested from the sweet from Sweden's forest. From a region called Dalarna. Timberwood? This is Timberwood and this tree is made is called spruce. Now you might ask yourself, how is that sustainable and you're cutting trees from the forest? Basically what what you can do to the, to, to, to actually manage that is that you give back to the forest. So each tree that was harvested, two to three trees were planted in the same area. And the trees were not harvested from one side of the forest. They were actually picked out throughout the whole forest. So we don't actually decrease the how those trees were eliminating the carbons in the atmosphere. Now, when we used only, only wood in our structure, which is 100% made out of wood, and we did not use any steel or cement, we saved 3,500 tons of carbon emission that we would have been producing if we used steel and cement. You might ask yourself, what are you going to do with all this tree, all this wood after uh, Expo is finished? This one and the whole pavilion, we can take it out, build it somewhere else without leaving any footprint behind us that we were even here and we are going to use the same wood and trees again in a different spot but if that didn't happen we still have the option because wood is very is sustainable and it's reusable and it's very recyclable so we can use this as a material for different products or different structures now throughout the exhibition each cluster has an interactive experience that being provided by our partners Swedish companies that are making the future more sustainable. So you can stop by by each cluster. You will find a guide that will help you out in that cluster. Thank you very much and Thank enjoy you your stay in the park. Thank you very much. So this material is 200 times stronger than steel and 1000 times lighter than steel. So a very very small quantity of it is required to strengthen any other metals or anything of that sort. And the others here as well. This one is a shirt. We'll have to go around to see it up front. And uh, this, it's made out of forest fibers, out of uh, material made out of uh, tree, mater tree parts. And it's recyclable. So once it's used and it's worn out, it can then be converted back into the pulp and then again into the threads and all of that. Okay, okay, okay. This is a, a car.
car? Yes, so this is an electric car uh, by the company Polestar mm -hmm. and electric cars are already sustainable but uh, what they are doing differently is for the interior of the car they are actually using 100% recycled plastic oh, okay. to make the material called nylon 6 for the interior of the car. And this That's whole what material doing. made from this forest? Uh, no, this one is made out of recycled plastic. Ah, this material, yeah. Ah, okay. So they're using discarded fishnets to actually make this the material for the interior of this car. Okay, great. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 